Welcome back to episode I don't even know anymore. I think we're on 19. Are you telling me that this key has either no use or it's not working? Am I supposed to clean this off? Look at this. Am I, was I supposed to clean this key off? Get a boy key from the cat. Go to room and find a pile of bomb outside. I heard a nurse and use a wire and open. I don't really thought of that, but uh I just as well. Go to PH, it's fine, fluffy go internally. Dude, why can't I not just clean the fucking key off? to unlock the gap or something? What is going on? I think it's just locked. Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely locked, but... But... What? You know, what about this? Oh, yeah, right. That could be all unlocked safe. Six. Yeah, I was a pause to come back to figure it out again. Well, apparently I'm fucking stupid, and there's a key somewhere in this room. It looks like a monkey. Well, baby's kind of you. Oh, for fuck's sake, this is one place I can check. Alright. So I'm guessing this unlocks a shelf. It has to. Come on. No, ah, oh, thank God. Try it. Yeah, got the key to the medicine room. Is it downstairs? Cause okay, cause I was gonna say there's a, there's a lot of gore down here. Diary. That newbie see yeah, first thing go for the diary. That newbie see may find mess. He spilled some hydrogen bromide and made a hole in the wall. I told him that stuff key through wire. He better pay me back for this. Oh. Hydrogen bromide? You can melt iron, huh? Maybe work on the door of the rooftop? So find some my hydrogen. Okay. That kind of root extract, my my coasts, capsules, my cardiopin, hydrochloride. I don't know any of these. Really? I think I have a couple. No, all of them. Triping tunnel. Lots of this stuff. What did it say it was for again? I don't know. Craziness. Uh. Potocin, estrogen, what are these for? I don't know. Zinc, ethanol, oxyl, mercury. Even I know these names. Yeah, you should. Oh, here we go. Hydrogen bromide. You gotta be careful of this. We found the high. Don't drop it. <laughs> if I fucking drop it, this is gonna be a, a huge hole in the floor. That's what I'm worried about. This you can eat through metal? Or iron? Iron. How am how I like, keeping like a little glass vial and like what, what am I holding it in? All right, let's try it. Work. I get rid of those wires of hydrogen bromide. Don't drift too much, or else there'll be a hole in the floor. Oh, I can use it. Okay. Stay back, fluffy. It's dangerous. Okay. Oh my hand! Hey, it's not working. This is fun. I nice see if the psychs for it. Whoosh. Look to the wire. The door cannot be opened. Alright, good to know. Oh, it's gonna save, but okay. Yay, we're outside. Hey, Fluffy, go run around. You'll fall. I can't see Mom from here. She wants to still be looking for the thing, that thing she lost. Hope she comes to find me soon. She'll be here soon, I'm sure. You sure love your Mama, huh, Fluffy? Yeah, Mom was the best. You like your Mama, Miss, Mr. David? No, he's like, sister. I was like, what? Yeah, I've got to love my Mama. I mean, my mother. Family's important. My mom's nice, but she's scary when she's mad. Is your mom nice? Flashback. I'm home. Are you feeling better, mom? Did you go to the hospital? 
Welcome home, honey. It's just a cold. Don't worry, I proportion. I feel a lot better after getting some rest. There's really no good side being feeble. I'm sorry to be always being causing you trouble. Don't worry about it. We're just a family of two. Of course we have to help each other. <laughs> They're so kind. Say, so how is it going with Shirley? She hasn't come here by here lately. We haven't met much because of work, though. I'd like to talk her with her more. I'd like to talk with her more. About the future and all that. She must be anxious. It's a big event in a woman's life. Make sure to support her, will you? Are you sure you're not in pain, Mom? You don't look very well. You can sleep. I can make my own meals. I'm glad you're such a kind son. Thank you, Davy. Yeah, she's very kind. She always cares about me. <laughs> you better get home soon, then, Mr. David. Your mom must be really worried. I suppose you're right. Same reason my ears will show up soon. So just wait with me until then. Yeah. Yeah. Because that still looks like, yeah, over old newspaper. Ah, oh, jeez, that noise. Psychiatrists at a local hospital commit, commit suicide. There was more a doctor played the general hospital. So, oh, that's that guy who hung himself. Well, shit. I saw a ladder back here. Oh, there's a item up there. Seems you can climb up it. Yeah, go up it. Why wouldn't you? Oh. Well, there's the last layer. Finally. Uh, I can't just, like, walk up it like a tile. I, I mean, I'd like that more. Where's the entrance? Where I come in through? Is it right here? Where is it? I'm having trouble finding. Oh, there we go. I was, I was having so much trouble trying to find the entrance. This never ha- this should never happen. He's having so much freaking trouble flying in. What's that noise? Hello? I don't like that. Oh, come on. We have to go find it. Oh, I hear it. Oh, I don't like this noise. I don't like this noise. It's really disgusting, you know. Oh, fuck. What is he doing? Don't walk closer. Eek. Is it... Is eating the embryo mod? Are you kidding me? Really? Oh, j Ow! Mr. David, you just punched me all the way across the room. My head. No, little boy, wrong, you look like a rape you! No, stay away. Oh, you fluffy! Ah, God, chase that monster. I got punched across the room. Damn, my head. I'm bleeding. So I just get punched across the room. Oh, wow, I took 50 freaking health? I have as much health as Fluffy. Fluffy! Fluffy! Can you go down the stairs? Go faster, you asshat! No. Can you just, like, go in and grab some Tylenol or something and come back out? Can you go up to the fourth floor? I want this. Whatever. I can be a weapon. Full free! Don't oh, shit. Uh, I don't want to stay away, stay away. That's it. Do something better than fire hydrant. Fire extinguisher, come on! Fuck it, yes! He's got my, that monster. Fuck you! Get away from all of me! even. Wow. I start off very easily. Thanks for getting you. Fluffy. You're not hurt? Nope, I'm fine. I'm sorry, Mr. David. It, it was my fault that you, you, you got hurt, Mr. David. It's okay. Not your fault. I didn't do anything. Bro. Mr. David! Oh, shit. I passed out. Right in front of a little boy, too. It's not your fault. Got big strut. Maybe I shouldn't say this, but this kind of thing happens all the time. If we had noticed a little sooner. Guys, die.